Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Monsters cereal. This box has four, four boxes inside. I have opened the top. Um, it has Fruit Brut. And I have the Count Chocula. And then we have Boo Berry. And then the last is the Frankenberry. So this box of these four cereals was only $7.98 at Sam's Club. $7.98. And these are, this, this Fruit Brut is a 9.3 ounce box. 9.6. Uh, 10.4 and 9.6. I think these are these are standard size boxes. size boxes. Yeah, <laughs> you're we're so used to seeing family size. These are regular size, giant boxes. size, family size. Yes, I think this is a normal size box of cereal, mm -hmm. but I think this is uh, for $7.98. I think it's a really good uh value. Uh, and plus, you can try different flavors, different people might like different things. Yeah, let's try the, the Count Chocula first. Okay. Um, yeah, Count Chocula, okay, chocolatey cereal with monster marshmallows. We did a review of these, I think like seven years ago on the channel. Okay. At the time, this kitchen was being renovated, so it was empty, nothing was in here. So we were having to do reviews out in the living room, which is terrible quality. So when you see that, if you will go back and look at that video, um, it's just uh, it's it's just a poorly lit. Everything is bad about it. So that's why, especially well, we filmed things differently back then and everything. We did uh, with different camera, everything's different. The sounds different, um, but we look different. <laughs> well, different. Um, but uh, so when I found out this collection was out and it had the fruit brute, I thought, well, heck, I've never even heard of fruit brute in my life. No, we have to try that. Yeah, even as a so, kid, I'm, I mean, that must have been later when I wasn't eating cereal. Uh, yeah, I have no idea. Uh, so, chocolatey cereal with mar monster marshmallows, one cup, 36 grams, is 140 calories. I put the bag back in the boxes. We don't have room for them. Yeah, we don't have room <laughs> for those. Okay. That's a really good cereal. It really is. It's, it's got a, yeah, they don't have a lot of excitement going on in the back. Um, it's got a good chocolatey flavor, but this, mm. the marshmallows are really, really flavorful. And it's sweet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the marshmallows are even seem sweeter than your regular marshmallows. Yeah, that is some super, super sweet cereal. And I mean, even the cereal pieces without the marshmallow, even the cereal itself is like super, super full mm -hmm. of, of yeah. sugar. You know what um, I like about them too is they taste chocolatey without tasting like cocoa. Right. I don't like cocoa powder flavor, which a lot of cereals are cocoa. These taste more like chocolate. Now, um, I don't know if, uh, we have another video. I'm pretty sure we reviewed them. They have these Count Chocula cereal bars, and I like them, but now Ashley, our daughter, absolutely loves them. And they're the little cereal bars, just like you would get the Golden Grahams bars, or the Fruit Loop bars, or Frosted Flake bars but they have Count Chocula bars that come out around Halloween time. I'm wondering why they never did like Frankenberry and Blueberry in, in, in those cereal bars. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> that tastes as good in milk as it does dry. Honestly, mm -hmm. it tastes better in milk, um, truthfully. It, it has a really good chocolate flavor. I mean, it, it is very sweet. There's no, and the marshmallows, we got like a, a greenish kind of color marshmallow and a gray oh. kind of color marshmallow. Yeah. Those are really good. Those are so cool. Um, the pieces of cereal themselves, the chocolate pieces, they could be a Miss Pac-Man ghost. They do. They kind of really look like do look like a Pac-Man ghost yeah. if you look at them. Uh, what do you think they're supposed to be? Ghosts. Monster marshmallows, chocolatey cereal. Yeah, I'm not about the chocolatey cereal. Yeah, but if you look at it, they're ghosts. 100%. Oh, they are ghosts. Yeah, okay. I mean, you look at the picture. Of them, okay, well, but they do look like a Pac-Man ghost. A Pac-Man specifically, a yeah. Pac-Man ghost. 
Yeah. Those I, are really good. I, I like love that cereal. I yeah. think it's delicious. There's good. nothing wrong with it. Mm. I don't if you know. like a good chocolatey flavored right. cereal, it's very, very good. Okay, what do you think next? Frankenberry smell. Okay, Frankenberry. Here we go. Yeah, I really do like the chocolate. Oh. Um, the I like it that it's not cocoa. Like I said, I, I like cocoa puffs. I never like cocoa puffs because they they taste like cocoa powder. And these are ghost shaped too. Okay. Ghost and something else. Oh no, they're uh, in strawberry little... strawberry flavored sweetened cereal with monster marshmallows. I don't know what the blue one Marshmallow is. shapes and colors may vary. Yeah, but those marshmallows don't really look like. They look like his head. With yeah, the and, and then out. some of them have like little ghosts. Like, and wait, one's a bat right there. Oh a bat. yeah, there is a bat shape. Let yeah, me put this back in here. I don't have a room for it. So I don't remember what I just said. Those were those were one forty for a cup. Wow. The well, that's different. It's a one and a third cup, so they've added more, and you get a hundred. It's one hundred sixty calories. These are distributed by General Mills. Okay. Let's just see what the blue one. So strawberry. You really can't tell what the marshmallows are until they expand out with milk. That is strong. I could eat that just to eat that cereal like candy. It's uh, it's very strong. It's it's almost like a strawberry candy. I know. I'm impressed because most of the time cereal, I'm impressed too. Cereal flavors are kind of just sweet to be sweet, and they don't have a lot of flavor to them. We've had a, a lot of strawberry cereal. I can tell you, this has to be the strongest mm -hmm. that we've had. I wonder what it's gonna be like in milk though. It's a very, very strong candy strawberry. Like there's nothing natural about no. it at all, but it's so sugary sweet. I love it. I think it's delicious. And you gotta let your marshmallow sit in the milk for a minute just to, to expand. Okay. Did your parents ever buy the cereal when you were growing up? Um, I think we bought the um, the Frankenberry occasionally, mm -hmm. and maybe the Blueberry. Not very often. It'd be something if I were at the if I was at the store and asked for it, then mm -hmm. they would buy it. But Mom never just bought it. I can honestly say that I never in my life have had tried these before we did this channel. Before, I guess seven years ago when we tried these. <laughs> he had never tried it. No. Um, that also a little bit of the strawberry flavor, but it's still very, very strong. It's just not as strong. Um, mm -hmm. Did you go to the store with your parents when you bought groceries though? Um, I did. I just don't think I paid any attention to um, anything. See, I was I, a, an oblivious little child. When I was a kid though, I went to the store with mom every time. Mm -hmm. So I would, I would ask for things, and I was the only child, so you know she bought it. And you know, um, I was that kid. I don't remember asking for anything. Yeah, if I wanted something like what, hey, what do you want for breakfast? Then I it might pick up cereal. You know, it's she would ask, but I mean, I wouldn't go to the store going, I want that, I want that. One. You know, I wasn't I, that kind of kid. But if mom was wanting to buy something, yeah, I have memories of things. I don't have a big memory of visiting the grocery, grocery store, store as a kid. Um, I don't. I do. Um, That's a really good cereal, regardless of us being kids. Um, it's a good cereal. It did lose a little bit of strawberry flavor, but it's still really good, good flavor. I, yeah, I think the, the flavor. Um, it's the the Count Chocula was, I think, equally strong in and out of milk. Yes. The strawberry, I do think, lost Quite some of its flavor when you put it in milk. I still like it, but I like it better out of the milk. Um, I did as far as flavor. Because you could eat it like little pieces of candy, truly. Yeah. But um, I do I do like it in milk too though. So. Yeah. So now this is boo berry, artificially berry flavored sweetened cereal with monster marshmallows. It's 160 calories for one and a third cup. And it looks like ghost, uh, that blue head and a bat or something. Oh, yeah, there's a bat. Pretty strong flavor. Mm -hmm. Once again, it's kind of like the strawberry. It's a very, very strong candy. Yeah. Almost to the point, the strawberry was like this too. Almost to the point of being a very artificial, like not chemical like, but almost there. I was going to say, there's no chemical flavor though to no, any of these. But it's almost there. 
I'm wondering, uh, you know, we don't see a lot of commercials. Right. Do they have commercials for these on TV like now for kids to see, like for for Gavin and Amelia, for our grandkids? Do like they, on Nickelodeon. Yeah, if you're watching Nickelodeon or, if, you know, do you see commercials for these cereals or is it something that you have to go down the cereal aisle or are they playing on people that are uh, a little younger than us on their you know their emotions and wanting them to buy it again what do you think mm -hmm. i like the flavor of that one the flavor stuck it's still not quite as strong but it did definitely mm -hmm. um, stay there a lot more than the strawberry product. that one's better in milk yeah, that's what I mean. The flavor stayed there a little bit more than the strawberry did. It's a good flavor. Mm -hmm. I don't, if I were blindfolded, I don't know if I would say blueberry. I would say it's more berry, mm -hmm. but um, but definitely a really good flavor. Yeah, I wouldn't say blueberry at all. I would just say that is a berry flavor, a very, very sweet berry flavor. Mm -hmm. That one's better in milk. Yes, I, I, I mean, I like it outside of milk, but like I said, it kind of all comes across as like a, almost to the point of being chemical. To me, it's not chemical at all. Oh this is a fruit brute. Yeah, this is one I've never tried this one. So this looks a lot like that uh, Frank, uh, Frankenberry. Yeah, fruit. Uh, fruit brute, artificially cherry flavored sweetened cereal with monster marshmallows. I do like some cherry, but I don't know about having it um, in, cereal. in cereal, so we'll see. 160 calories for one and a third cup. They they um, they could have done so much more with the backs of these boxes, and I know they don't care, you know. Lots of them. But they uh, they missed an opportunity. This this says enter for your chance to win a cause K A W S monster prize. What's that cause? K -A -W -S. I don't know. What's Is it maybe cause? a brand or something? This one has little orange pieces. In wow! It. Did you smell it's that? Very strong. Yeah, the monster piece stood being blue in the in the last two. These are orange. Wow. I don't know that I like that cherry flavor. It's okay. Now that it's settled in, it's not bad. At first I thought, ooh, that I don't know if I like that. It's just like the strawberry. It's a very strong candy cherry mm -hmm. flavor there's nothing natural about oh, it no, um that's all the milk i have mm -hmm. so um it's almost like a almost a harsh flavor though it's i don't know this has yellow pieces in it too orange and yellow it's really i bright. don't think it um i don't think i don't think there's anything negative about it uh to me but i've never you know kevin's like bordering chemical whatever i don't feel that way i don't feel any of them had any kind of uh bad flavor to them at all it is different having cherry in cereal definitely but to me it's it's just like a strong candy cherry no flavor i would pick it's not it's not bad it's just it's just not bad. It's not my favorite. That's why I didn't stick around. Absolutely. It's good. Don't get me wrong. It, it's, uh, it's, if you buy the four pack, you're definitely going to eat it. Um, that's not one I would go out and buy a whole box of just by itself at, at the store. I just don't like that cherry flavor enough. I have no idea if they're going to sell these on the shelves this year alone as a standalone cereal with the other ones because the they, fruit break the know. fruit break because right. they come out every year with the cow chocula frankenberry blueberry you can buy those separately if you want to i have no idea is this a sam's club thing to where you have to get it in this box or are you going to be able to get this i can tell you right now if they bring this out it will sell no, yeah, people will buy it just for the style. People will buy it for the box. Uh, I've already told Kevin, I will keep these boxes. This is something that my a part of my Halloween decorations, um, years ago, I had Kevin print out the covers of some of these boxes, and we laminated them. Well, this year, I will actually cut the front of this box, and I will keep these boxes to decorate with on my bookshelves because just because i think they're cool um so people will buy this um i actually like it i think it's very different okay. um 
it is a strong cherry. It's a flavor that you're not used to having in cereal. Do I think you would want it all the time? No, but none of these cereals are available all the time. But for one time a year, yeah, for you to have something then, I, guess. I actually do like the cherry flavor. Yeah, it's okay. I, like I said, if I were, if I had these four boxes on the shelf, that's not the one I would choose. If I had the four boxes on the shelf, so let's pull them over so we can gander at them again. Um, I know which one am I buying without hesitation? Mm -hmm. The Count Chocula. Me too. These two. The um, strawberry, yeah. the, the Frankenberry, and the Count Chocula Those are my are, two favorites um, out of the four. No, mine would be the, the Count Chocula and the Blueberry. And the, I like it too. I do. I, I genuinely do like the other ones. It's just that somebody has to come in last. Mm -hmm. um, honestly, probably the Fruit Brute would come in last. But I do think it's different enough. I think that if you haven't had it before like us, you're going to want to try it. Oh yeah, definitely try that. If they come out, I would, I would think if they're making it, if they're producing it, if they're making kind of boxes, it, then why wouldn't they sell why it? Why wouldn't you put it in a separate box? Yeah, yeah, so you all are gonna have to let us know. I'm sure somebody out there knows a lot more than we do about it. You'll have to let us know. Um, yeah, give them, give it another uh, couple weeks and they'll be out on shelves anyway. Yeah, so. exactly. So I hope you all are excited to see them as I was to get them. Um, I think they ought to sell different little characters and everything. Yeah, there with and them. the big thing. Because I would decorate with the them. The contest on the back, that's all they're talking about on the back. They could have done some games. They could have done something else. Well, they could have had some fun games or like a cemetery or a haunted house or something like that. You know, I, I'm, I'm all about the fun and games too. Mm -hmm. So. So, uh, so the back of the box is a little bit disappointing, but I, I'm just glad we got to try them all again. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.